Warning, gun safety is very critical to the survival of others and yourself. So don't fuck around. This shit is important. Okay, I'm the only one in this room professional enough that I know of to carry this block for it. I'm the only one. Elevator by accident. It happened on camera to parking garage in Cincinnati. Oh Officer Daryl Jewett's weapon. Now, if you want on this 44 Magnum, you can shoot it single action. Like a basic hammer action. Now, normally you wouldn't do this, but it's because... Again. It's your boy, GW. You already know what we're here for. It is gun safety time. It is a lot of y'all out here being negligent, ignorant, and a whole lot of other words that I do not care to say on camera. But we're going to keep it moving. Gun safety. So, it's two parts to this. I'm going to give you the universal rules, and I'm going to give you GW's rules. Universal, these are the golden rules. Everybody should know these rules. It shouldn't be debated upon. It's only four of those rules. Rule number one, all guns are loaded. Glock 43 right here on the table in front of us. This gun is loaded. You know nothing about it. Like all you know is that you see a gun. As soon as you see a gun, think that gun is loaded. You don't know if it's one of the chamber or not. You don't know how that person rocking. You don't know nothing about them or what they got going on. Rule number two, Never let the muzzle cover anything you're not willing to destroy. For instance, this muzzle is right now conveniently pointing at my window. I accidentally shot the one at. Which I don't want it to destroy, but hey, I can afford to replace a window versus my TV, you know, or, the, or, or you know, whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, rule number three. Keep your finger off the trigger until your target is in sight. That should be self-explanatory. Now, if you want on this 44 Magnum, you can shoot it single action. Rule number four, also self-explanatory. Be sure of your target. I'm going to say it one more time. Be sure of your target. Self-explanatory. Hey. Now we finna dive into GW's rules. G Dub, you know what I'm talking about. I'm about to give you the real. And I only got six of them things. Six, 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 six. Number one. Practice? We in here talking about practice. I mean, it, listen, we talking about practice. Yes. Practice. You got to practice. I'm talking about range time. I'm talking about these classes that everyone has to offer in all these different states and cities. Man, they got tactical classes. They got concealed carry classes. They got fire. Sh they got, um, my bad. They got firearm handling classes as well. They have aim proficiency classes. There's so many different ways that you can get better with your firearm. Don't think just because you just watched Pooh Shiesty back in blood and you, you know, you, you think shit, fuck it. Hey, bro, look, I can do, man. I might go, man, what's up? They shoot him! They shoot him! Somebody shoot him! No! Get your ass! No. Practice. You ain't in the field. You ain't in the streets like that. You ain't never did nothing to, to have the practice or the mental fortitude to understand what this gun is and what it can do practice number two we all know this one this is this is the hood universal rule better to have it than to not have it another man with a gun and his waistband is following him then the man goes to his car and pulls out an ak style pistol moments later both start firing shots at one another you, can see you better keep it on you at all times just carry at all times 
And I'm saying this because you never know what's going to happen. You could be going out Sunday evening, going to fill your car, your wife's car at that. Fill her gas up because she don't like doing it, whatever it may have you. Boom. Four of them. Right there. Dracos. Mm. But if you if you properly and adequately trained and practiced and you know how to use your personal firearm, my brother, you might get out there. Ain't no telling. That's four people. I just threw, I, I threw out a extremely fucked up scenario. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But still, in the event, having something to protect yourself is very, very crucial. Keep it on you. Number three, I think this should have been number one. Bro, if you ain't finna shoot nobody, you not finna, you not finna, man, look, stop pulling your gun. If you not finna pop no body. What? Are you okay, Tiger? Let's go to primary, sir. Yes, sir. Let's go to primary. Stop pulling your gun. If it, hey, if you now if you feel like your life is threatened, hey, by all means, do what you gotta do. I can't I can't tell you how to feel in them situations. But for the love of God, if you ain't finna pop nothing. Stop pulling your pistols, your your K's, your ARs, your shotty. Stop pulling your man. Come on, bro. Don't come on. Oh, now this is something that I think is not talked about a lot. Man, get a holster for your gun. That's important. Get a holster for your gun and get comfortable with your gun. That's a two in one. But we gonna keep it just one rule. And that's number four. Get a holster for your gun and get comfortable with your gun. That being said, you need holsters because, man, for one, a lot of us are riding with one in the head. You reach into your pocket the wrong way, pull you as you pulling out, you fire you fired off into your elbow or you fired off into your partner. Now, there's so many accidental deaths and situations going because people are not having proper gun safety. And that's so crucial. Number five, stop playing with guns. I wouldn't pull the gun out, and I don't feel comfortable having... <laughs> I'm not going to shoot you, bro. Don't do that. <laughs> bro, it's too many. It's too many. I don't even want to do it. I don't even want to imitate you clowns. Like, I'm going to be real with you. It's too many people grabbing a gun. Oh, Oh, you know, we in this thing. Oh, you know, hey, what's up? Hey, nah, bro, like, what's up at home, bro? Now, like I said, the Universal Rule said, All guns are loaded. Yeah, shit, I ain't even say it. All guns are loaded. You know, man, you don't know, you don't know what could happen. Even if you know it's not one in the chamber. Your partner don't know that shit. The, the, the whoever rolling by don't know that shit or whoever see you doing the shit don't know that shit. And that's important. That leads straight into my final rule. Number six. Mindset. It's all about mindset. If you don't have the mental fortitude to properly assess a situation, to know if you need to pull your weapon or to shoot your weapon or just, you know what I'm saying, to even think about your weapon, if you don't have the mental fortitude to do that, to understand and properly anal uh, analyze a situation, you don't need to go purchase a firearm. That's just point blank, period. You don't need it. Go get you some security or something, big fella. Go take some boxing lessons, some UFC, some martial arts or something, because, hey, you supposed to know how to scrap anyway. That, that's off top. You already supposed to know how to scrap. You supposed to have something from the shoulders. You, you don't want to fight because you ain't got nothing from here. I'm talking about from here. I ain't talking about from here. This easy. But the, 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 that, that firearm life, that's not for you. If you just, oh, oh, he want to fight me? Oh, oh. <clears throat> nah, bro. That's not for you. Mindset. It's not the, that's not what this was made for. That would this wouldn't sit in place to protect you from a scrap. Just saying, that's gun safety. That's G Dub six. Rule. Six, 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 It's G Dub's six rules. There you go. Uh, 
of gun safety. So, before I leave y'all, I'm gonna leave a little link to my Instagram. Follow your boy on Instagram. You know, I'm going to be doing some giveaways next month, uh, coming in mid-July, end of July. I want to do at least two different giveaways next month. So, that's why I'm going to be doing it on Instagram. Tap in, y'all. Tap in. You don't want to miss it. It's going to be something real cool for you guys. Also, like, comment, subscribe. Oh,